Hey, welcome to SC Custom Designs, where we finally are putting on the finish coat on the north side and a little bit of the eastern side here. Lots of work in 2019. Main roof, completely brand new. Compromised places were replaced. The dormers wrapped with vinyl and metal, sheet metal. Lovely one, and I believe my daughter Liz helped pick out the color. I think that's what happened. And so I thought this was a good time to do this video. The original color to this house when we bought it was, well, almost bare. <laughs> it was greatly neglected. So 20 years ago, I put this pink on there with blue trim at the very very top and some other color so it was like three colors now we have this color here I won't even try to guess what color this is it's not my gifting if you've never seen this ladder in action and it won't be today but it's a very versatile ladder I think I'll do a demo let's see custom designs oh so it's Memorial Day and it um, doesn't feel like I got a lot done, but so the very, very top fascia and soffit area has the final coat on it. And you can see the difference there. Um, zoom in a little bit. This is Kills Primer. And then we uh, went over with uh, good quality paint we got on sale Memorial Day. So it really cleaned it up. It looks really, really sharp. Although the video doesn't look so good. Maybe it'll look better as I see it. But there you go. Progress. Boy, does that feel good. Lovely one went up with Josh and Tabby's to Lake Moreau. It's usually where we go on Memorial Day. But um, got to keep going with the progress. Boy, I tell you what, I feel really good about this. Thanks for watching this sequence of designs. We will be back in the wood shop at some point. Ooh, we got some paint there. I got paint everywhere. We will be back in the shop at some point, making that coffee table out of the uh, company sign, the works on it, Worldwide Environmental Regulatory Compliance Systems. So bear with me while we get what we have to get done. I have to be done with this by the end of June. So uh, it's a good chance I'll get it done. I'll show you the various stages. I did power wash uh, the house. Um, oh dear. And that really saved me, uh, saved me time. Scraping, scraping, but I still have a good amount of scraping that uh, has to be done. So my lovely one wants me to take the clapboard off and put posts in there, more traditional. So you can see this side here is really in its rough. Soon it's going to be done. All right, thanks for. Let's look down here and get an idea of what we see here. We, we get a lot of compliments on the on our guard in the front. The peonies, particularly, are huge. Give you an idea, this is about a foot and a half uh, height. The uh, stone wall I put in a couple years ago. And look how look how lovely that is. Rose of Sharon there. Azalea. Azalea, boy, that guy up there was really amazing. Really, really beautiful. I love the different seasons. And this is a nice surprise. I didn't expect these guys were going to come back, but they did. I planted these guys last year. And we have the um, English ivy. Really lovely. I love the... I got the permission from the lovely one to let these rows of Sharon's grow, which is going to nice, be nice to fill in this area. I well, like to have a little bit of privacy on my front porch. Now, there you go. I planted this uh, 
I'm going blank right now. Lilac. Oh, so, so fragrant, this. Very, very fragrant. So yeah, he's, he's really getting established. And uh, we have a lilac in the back. I'll finish the video up. Let me zoom back out. We'll finish the video up in the backyard. Here's two more that I planted, one here, and these just starting to pop there. And here's Dexter. Say hi, Dex. Say hi, Dex doors to grandpas. Yeah. <laughs> Dexter freaks himself out. He is so funny. <laughs> so here's the back of the house. Looks haunted, don't it? But, uh, oh man, like I said, the roofs, all the roofs are done. The uh, attic is breathing. The main roof is finally breathing with the ridge vents. So it's going to be really, really nice. All right, pray to God some when they're done flipping this house that we get some nice neighbors in there. All right, thanks for watching. Don't know what those are called, but they're awesome. <laughs> this hair bush is good for when you get a bruise. You wrap that around your bruise and uh, it helps to heal up. All right. Take care, God bless. Subscribe to my channel if you'd like. Usually it's woodworking, but this is the exterior. Getting it done. Thanks, Spike. God bless.